I think I was on a very early stage, I was already aimed to be an artist. So I think uh, that a good artist is not only that you can see uh, nice paintings or nice drawings, but it's almost like it's, it's life itself. Art is life. So I start off mostly with uh, the copies of uh, old gravures and uh, 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 drawings and, and pictures of the 19th century. And I start cutting and paste them like a collage. And that's mostly where I start off a picture. Well, that's a misunderstanding. I am not a painter. I used to paint uh, uh, also uh, when I studied and later on when I had a large studio. But I found out that a lot of artists, other artists could paint really much more and could express themselves much more. So I draw them actually on uh, metal plates, zinc or copper, or even nowadays on uh, acetate, which is a very highly modern plastic. Rembrandt never dreamed about it, but I can make etchings with plastic. These uh, I can reproduce on paper by the means of the old technique. So you uh, put ink on a plate, you wipe the ink off, and oh, there comes the picture. So I. I developed my own uh, handwriting within the technique of old uh, graphics, uh, the etching. And uh, in that I found, uh, an, I think, a post-modern new way of uh, using uh, old material in uh, a new form. fascination for animals, especially the birds, come from uh, my uh, repeated dreams I have about flying. Most of the time when I dream, I dream of flying. That came back into the, in my pictures that I used uh, birds as a symbolic for myself, as my alter ego. Well, um, I'm highly interested in the 19th century. Um, some people even say I was born in the wrong century. Uh, so I collect all, already from childhood uh, picture books from the 19th century, uh, rare photographs, uh, strange objects. And uh, these are the inspiration for my work. You put it under a press and there comes a picture. I write poems or songs or strange words under, under or over it and that's the final stage of my art piece. Well, in these troubled times, it's hard to say. Um, as, as an artist, I see my future as a never-ending story till the day I die. As a human being, uh, I hope I'll live a long and happy life, but circumstances in these days are a little bit different than when I started in this uh, glorious 60s when the hippie, the hippie stardom was uh, around. But I'll think I'll manage. My time will come. Mm -hmm.